Hey y'all, Jamio here, and today I am here to settle the debate between cans versus bottle when it comes to beer. Hey y'all, so first off, as you know, I'm changing up the channel a little bit, so food tech is going to be kind of a sporadic thing, so when y'all have questions or when I see things that could be shared that would help to increase your food knowledge I'll just be sharing them instead of only committing to on Wednesdays um, and it'll be more than just gadgets because I really like that you all can, can learn more about food and the technology that goes along with food which sometimes can be as simple as things like cans versus bottles so let's get started so as I shared in another video um, if I'm drinking beer out of the container I'd much prefer the bottle um, but when it comes to actual taste and trying to make sure I get that exact taste that it would that the beer would be like on tap, I have to go with the can. Um, and so there's a lot of people who say that cans are gross, they're horrible, and I thought this for the longest time. But then I realized kegs are actually a giant can. So if you think about it, a keg, so when the brewer finishes brewing the beer, they put the beer into a giant keg. And that's the best that beer will ever taste is straight off, straight out of the tap. But if you have a can though, it's basically just like having a little mini keg. So we don't think about it that way and people will say, well in the can it tastes like, a, it tastes metally, I don't like the way it feels, I don't like the way it tastes. And that's true, you're absolutely right. If you drink it out of the can, it's not going to taste very good. It is going to have this metallic taste that you're not going to enjoy. But if you pour it in a glass, it's going to be just like it would be on tap. So if I'm having a beer for the first time, and it's something, especially from a craft brewery that I'm not going to be able to get to for a while or something like that. If they have a can option, I'll go for the can option so that I know what it would taste like on tap. So if you want to know what the beer actually tastes like, I mean, go for it in the can. With that said, when I do buy like a Bud Light, because Bud Light is about the only beer I'll buy that's mainstream, um, in the can, I don't like it at all unless I'm going to put it in... A glass and even then I don't really like it all that much but in the bottle I do and the bottle does change the flavor that's why you'll see like say darker bottles um, because they're trying to block out the light with the bottle versus seeing like soda in a clear bottle because they're not as worried about the light hitting it so you know the light makes the beer break down and it kind of just basically spoils it um, we talked about in a previous video how hops keeps beer from spoiling um, same thing with the bottle and the type of container in the can you don't have to worry about any light penetrating at all so it's gonna last way longer and it's gonna have more to the truer taste because in the keg you wouldn't be worried at all about light hitting the beer the other benefits to can versus bottles and this is true for pretty much anything while I love the use of like say mason jars or glass bottles for soda I swear sodas taste better in a glass bottle. I don't drink a lot of soda, but when I do, it's usually from a glass bottle. It's not as easy or as common for glass to be recycled as the aluminum used in cans. So almost all the drink cans you see are actually made from recycled material, and it can be recycled again and again and again. So that's just another perk to drinking out of the can. So if you're committed to having a glass, definitely go for the can if you want the better taste, if you want to help the environment, but I understand drinking out of the bottle too. If you all have any questions or any comments on this in your experience, please leave the comments down below. Also, please share this video if you liked it so that more can learn about this subject. And until next time, thanks for watching.